We are living in a world where we witness an international rush to the moon. The advancement in technology since the Apollo era and the discovery of water in the lunar poles made the moon the priority destination. However, an important challenge is that the majority of world populations are still left behind and they are not part of the moon rush. I believe going to the moon should be for the mutual benefit of humanity. Involving new players will distribute risks, funds, and benefits. Everyone agrees that going to the moon should be an international effort, but nobody knows how this partnership will look like. There are many legal and moral discussions that require the involvement of parties from emerging space countries and non-spacefaring countries. In other words, everyone should be involved to shape the future of human quest in the moon. Let's not export our problems on Earth to the moon. So the question now, how to involve everyone to the moon rush? The Moon Village Best Project, or the Moon Village Participation of Emerging Space Countries, is the only program in the world that provides practical steps for the public-private sectors with a focus on the youth in an emerging space country to be part of the moon rush. The aim of the project is to identify opportunities in the Moon Village by creating a roadmap and supporting the youth to implement this roadmap. The Moon Village Association goal is the creation of a permanent global informal forum for stakeholders like government, industry, academia, and the public interested in the development of the Moon Village. As a, as a young professional in a non-spacefaring country, I see the goal of the Moon Village Association inspiring. The BISC project is practical in the sense that it provides mentorship for the participants in a structured way to come up with their roadmaps. But writing the roadmap is just the beginning. The BISC project is about communicating this roadmap to potential stakeholders. And this is the importance of the public-private partnerships. The participants can be an independent group of young professionals, a private company, or a part of space agency. Stakeholders also can be from the public or private sectors. As seen, the process of communicating the roadmap is iterative and might take years until the actual involvement in the Moon Village happens. We have made a first step for a truly international effort toward the Moon. As we speak today, we have 14 teams from 14 countries from around the world currently working in the roadmaps. We don't stop dreaming, and we want to see all countries part of the moon rush.